reactor parts or components uh, as we can see in this uh, image we have uh, a tractor uh, the first part here will be the front wheels the rear wheels the radiator radiator fan the engine the tractor engine then we have the flywheel and the clutch after the clutch we have the gearbox the gearbox here the tractor pulley the tractor pulley in this part the differential system the differential system and we have here the draw bar as we mentioned before in the first and the uh, previous part uh, when we talked about the tractor classification according to the draw bar pull so uh, this is the draw bar another uh, image uh, the elevation uh, as you can see the front wheel the rear wheel uh, the engine then we will have a lecture about the engine itself later uh, the clutch flywheel and the clutch then we have the gearbox and the differential here we have the BTO the BTO or the power take of X the tractor pulley can be uh, in the right side of the tractor as in this image here in the right side and as in this photo also it can be behind the tractor uh, close to or driven by the BTO so the BTO gives the power to the tractor pulley so the tractor pulley can be in the right side or behind the tractor uh, the tractor power uh, we can use the engine power and the brake power the BTO power the draw bar power and we are going to talk about them power as we are going to talk later have two kind uh, the engine uh, have two kind of power have indicated power and brake power indicated the engine power can be indicated power uh, which is theoretical power theoretical power and brake power brake power uh, which is the actual engine uh, power the indicated power uh, is a calculated uh, or a theoretical power uh, and it's a function uh, of the bore or the diameter uh, of the cylinder uh, cylinder pressure number of cylinder uh, rotational speed of the engine and it's called indicated power uh, indicated power is not a useful power as we said it's indicated or theoretical uh, and it's not usable power uh, available from the tractor uh, the the brake power uh, comes from term brake uh, comes from the brony brake brony brake is used to measure so the brake power is a measured power not calculate not just a theoretical or indicated no it's measured uh, 
power from the engine uh, the brake power is available or uh, at the flywheel of the engine it's not useful rating for the tractor itself it's just uh, available from the engine at its fly uh, wheel uh, how we can uh, measure the brake power of the engine simply uh, using uh, this brake uh, or this device it's called the brake power the engine X or the engine flywheel will be in this place here and these wooden blocks uh, are used to, to break uh, the axe uh, and we use the weights uh, to measure the force in this arm so if we have the arm lens which is this place arm lens and if we measure the rotational speed or the RPM or N rotational speed N and we have the weight which is uh, the force here we can calculate the torque torque will be equal to torque force time arm length and after calculating the torque uh, we can calculate uh, we can calculate the power power equal to 2 by n t t is the torque n is the rotational speed but by a, a revolution per second not per minute so we have to convert if we have the n by rpm or by revolution per minute we have to convert it to revolution per second to calculate the power with what so if we have the torque by newton meters newton meter and the n by revolution per second we can use this uh, equation uh, 2 by nt to calculate the power with uh, what and as we said before this power is the power available at the flywheel of the engine uh, it's the available power uh, to size stationary engine uh, for uh, irrigation pump and uh, similar uses but not for the tractor <coughs> the power take off or the BTO power is the power available at this X which called power take off uh, or BTO uh, the, the BTO uh, supply a rotary power used for stationary work as we mentioned before uh, too many different types of machine such as uh, pillars bumps and mowers so the power take off or the BTO power is the power available at the BTO uh, which placed uh, at the uh, rear size of the engine uh, or the behind the engine uh, it used to uh, drive bumps uh, pillars and mowers uh, as we said uh, in the BTO or uh, the brake power uh, uh, the BTO is a rotary power used for stationary work and 
uh, its power can be calculated according to the law uh, power equal 2 by nt to by nt so so this law 2 by nt can you can be used for calculating the power for stationary uh, work but uh, if we use the draw bar to pull uh, a machine behind the tractor while it's moving so it's not a stationary work it's attractive work uh, tractive work or the tractive power can be accord uh, can be calculated according to the relation uh, the draw bar power or the tractive uh, power equal force F for force time V for velocity or the speed uh, speed uh, is distance over time so uh, if we have the weight or the force that engine uh, use and its speed while it's moving uh, it's attractive work as we said before so force time velocity or uh, force time speed uh, equal the draw bar bar or the attractive uh, power uh, usually the engine uh, power is the highest power and as we said it's not the usable power uh, then Uh, the BTO power and the lowest power is the draw bar power this uh, drive us to the 86% uh, rule the 86% rule said that 86% of engine power uh, are uh, goes to the BTO so 86% of the engine power goes to the BTO and 86 of uh, percent of the BTO uh, goes to the uh, draw bar so as we said the engine power engine power is the greatest value 86% of this value goes to the BTO or the power takeoff and 86% of the BTO goes to the draw bar it's not uh, accurate uh, but it can be used uh, for estimations uh, uh, or estimating the power of the tractor uh, and the manufacturers of the tractors in their uh, advertise or advertisement they usually use the engine power uh, to announce uh, the highest possible number uh, to make their uh, tractor uh, competitive in the marketplace but they don't use the usable power that's why we have to know the different uh, kind of power uh, as we mentioned before the engine power what's the difference between the theoretical or the indicated power of the engine what uh, do we mean when we say the brake power of engine and uh, as we mentioned before we have to know that the BTO power is less than the engine power and also the draw bar is less than or 86% of the BTO uh, to know uh, the usable power of the engine uh, even if we are listening or watching uh, advertise uh, advertisement about the tractors. Uh, thanks for listening uh, and 
Goodbye.